Hi. Good morning, my lovelies. We're back on the allotment this morning. I'm not going to do too much, but I was really excited. I made a, with my son last night, I made a, um, my own little water butt that I'm hoping will work. Um, and literally it was just, I bought a, for two pound on Facebook, I managed to buy a water container. So I'm now going to buy more of these. maybe two or three and then I can dot them round the allotment um, now I know that it works and I filled it with rainwater but I'm going to cut the top out and so it can fill itself with rainwater and obviously conserve the rainwater when it does rain um, and then attached myself me and my son attached this tap I got off eBay for £3.50 a water butt tap um, and then obviously a bit of pipe i've just done a small bit it has got kinks in it so i think that's why it's running a little bit slower than i i'm hoping it'll run better with a better pipe which i've got um but i just i'm going to use that pipe for making my own small polytunnel um so that'll be another video i'm going to make use some old pipe that i was given off facebook we've got great facebook groups here uh, it's definitely worth asking on Facebook if anyone is getting rid of things so that you can reuse them. So I got two huge loads of um, hose pipe and I'm going to cut those in sections, put them over my planters and then make a little greenhouse. And I'll make a video of that so it'll make more sense uh, when I get to doing that. But that'll protect the young plants um, with netting, some net curtains that I've got. So I'm going to make a... A tunnel a netting tunnel out of those and it's all free brilliant um but this water butt is working i've just tested it you'll see the video in a minute um and i think the kinks are in the, there's two big kinks in the pipe so it was running well but not as well as i would hope but i think it's the kinks obviously so really pleased with it um and it cost me 550 to make instead of they i don't know how much you i think water butts are quite expensive you can get them for about 10 pounds second hand on facebook but i made it myself for 550 um obviously not as big as a huge water butt but i don't have a greenhouse or shed or anything or any guttering to find a source so i'm going to make it an open water butt um and dot them around so that i have access to a hose pipe rather than the watering can uh because the plot takes quite a lot of watering um and i don't always have time so it's easier to fill those up if i need to than it is to fill the watering can 20 times or well more than 20 times it would take um so that's my plan so i'm really happy that's going to really really help my watering on the allotment so i'm really chuffed with that uh and now I'm going to go home, walk puppy, and then I'm going to sit. I've started to draw my plots now. And I'm going to plan uh, some succession planting. So I'm going to plan the plot and then I'm going to plan uh, spring, summer, autumn, winter, uh, what they're going to be doing and have a rough idea of what I'm going to do. And then obviously I'll change it month by month with what's ready to go in and stuff. Um, and build my mini greenhouse and sow some seeds. So that's what I hope I can do today. Uh, but the plot is really coming together now, so there's not an awful lot of things. It's now little projects I want to do, like my little water butt systems dotted around and um, my, obviously the weeding at the top there, which I'm just cheating over. So I do need, to, I've still got the odd jobs and the poo pile I need to move. But other than that, it's looking really, really good now. I'm really happy and I want to start planting the peas and broad beans now. Um, so that's why I'm plotting out what I'm doing so I don't plant them up and then realise I want to put them somewhere else because because of other things I'm growing. So um, that is my plan. But I'll share the video now of, of the, the water butt that I've just made and tested and... Uh, I'm very pleased with it. So um, if you've got any questions or 
even any bits of advice ha happily welcome um please do let me know in the comments below and if you've not already subscribed please subscribe and click that notification bell so you can keep up to date with what i'm doing i'm at the moment i'm so excited with it i'm doing things daily at the moment uh, or every other day i'm sure i'll start slowing down soon but uh but we are very busy on the plot so if you want to keep up with what we're up to then uh, ring that bell and make sure you subscribe bye bye Right, fingers crossed. Fantastic. Fantastic. I hope it thinks so. Probably be even better. But that is great news. What I'm going to do is leave that there.